Hey guys, Alf here. Um, it's been a while since I've had something to unbox for you guys, and uh, but today something special came out. And there hasn't really been anything really big to come out to unbox, so I haven't done any. But uh, today the Super Nintendo Classic Edition, or the SNES Mini, whatever you want to call it, came out. So uh, before I do the unboxing, let me tell you a little story of how fucking fortunate I was to get this. So um, I work nights, and I get out at 8.30 in the morning. Um, the GameStop opens at 10. Um, my friend Rita said she'd come with me. So, uh, around eight o'clock or so, I texted her and said, 30 minutes left. I'm going to get out. She was like, okay, I'm on my way. So she gets there at about 8.15 and texts me and says, I'm seven, I'm in, I'm 17th in line, you know, like hurry up. And I'm like, shit, I can't hurry up. I got to get a, you know, I got to stay till 8.30. So I'm like, fuck, but I'm, I'm already feeling nervous. Cause when the NES mini came out, I got out at 8.30 and I looked down and I was like eighth in line. And, um they didn't have too many copies i think there was like 12 copies or something so i was like damn if she's 17 and they get the same amount of copies i'm not gonna get one fuck so well eight o'clock comes i run over there's only one person behind her so i come up you know i say hi and i pretty much stand next to her in line the whole time uh i'm there's one girl behind her so i'm thinking you know uh fuck you know i'm not the kind of person to cut in line and take someone's spot so if there's like only enough to let to like one person after my friend that I'm going to have to give it to this girl because I'm not I'm just not that kind of person. I can't just do that. So, you know, I'm not going to take her spot. So I'm like, fuck, I hope there's enough. Right. So we're there. Uh, waited an hour and a half. Right. We see like an hour later, the manager comes. He goes inside. I'm like, well, they haven't said anything. Last time they said how many copies they had, like well before they even opened just to let everybody know and the people waiting and he hasn't said anything. So I'm like, all right. So these, they've probably it's probably because they have a lot of copies. So, yeah, uh, we wait an extra half hour. The time comes. It's 10 o'clock. The guy comes out and he says, we only have 19 copies. And I'm like, oh, fuck. So I'm thinking, all right, my friend's 17 in line. The girl behind her was 18. So I'm 19. I'm going to get the last copy. So he let everybody in. And yes, sure enough, uh, there was 19 of them. I got the last copy. And I'm, fuck, I'm like, oh, my God. Thank God. So uh, the girl behind me was like, really, she was the one being like, oh, my God, I'm so lucky. You know, I'm the last in line. I'm going to get it. And I, you know, and I look at her and I'm like, you know, I would have let you had it. I would have let you have it if they only had 18 copies, because you know, you were here first, you know. So, either way, you know, she smiled and and she didn't say thank you or anything, but she smiled. You know, she she acknowledged that I would have done that. And uh, so basically, you know, I'm really happy I got it. And uh, here it is, SNES Mini. So uh, let me cut cut out and I'll unbox it for you guys. All right, guys. So here it is. There's the NES Mini. Here's the box show you all the sides as I did before boom, boom, boom. all the games in it uh, let me read it out to you because it might be hard to read uh, Contra 3 Alien Wars Donkey Kong Country Earthbound one of my favorite games of all time uh, Final Fantasy 3 my favorite Final Fantasy of all time F-Zero Kirby's Dream Course Kirby Superstar Mega Man X fantastic fucking game Secret of Mana also a great game Star Fox Street Fighter 2 Turbo Hyper Fighting Super Castlevania 4, Super Ghouls and Ghosts, Super Mario Kart, a bunch of good games. All of those are really good. Super Mario RPG Legends of the Seven Stars. I used to love that game, and it's been years since I played it, so I'm really excited to get back on that. Uh, Super Mario World, Super Metroid, of course, classic. Super Punch-Out, another classic. Legend of Zelda Link to the Past, one of the best Zelda games ever. Zoldi uh, Zoldies. <laughs> Yoshi's Island, and Star Fox 2 which is an unreleased game. It was it was finished, but never released, and they finished it. Well, I guess it wasn't fully finished. It was almost finished, and they canceled it, and they did the final bit to finish it now so they can release it in this and make this a very special little console you can pick up with, an, with a game that you can find nowhere else. Uh, well, yeah, that's all the sides. Let me get this open now. really excited for this because Super Nintendo is probably one of my favorite consoles of all time and I'm really happy I got to get you know I had the the, the mini NES and now I got to have the mini SNES that says now you're playing with power here how cool is that super classic all right put the box down here it is first thing that comes out uh, oh, it looks like a little poster. Let me let me put this aside. I'll show this to you later when I can get a wider view. You like how I did this? Like like it's talking, right? I'll show you this later. 
right, let's see what we got here. Now I see the plug, which is probably the same as that can be used for NES Mini, but it's good to have both. Uh, there's a controller. Hooks in just like the NES Mini, it has the, the Wii type of input. But the controller is exactly like an SNES controller. It feels exactly the same. The buttons feel exactly the same with the, you know, the concave ones and the, and the, these buttons that stick out. Fucking awesome. It feels just like the original. I love it. Now, what is this? Oh, two controllers. See, this time they were smart enough. The NES Mini only came with one controller and it was really hard to get another one. This one, they were good enough to give you two this time. I guess they are charging an extra 20 bucks and it has 10 less games, so... Uh, more cables, HDMI input, uh, the USB for the plug, and here it is. Boom, boom. Move this. Let's get in on this. Boom! Look at this. It's a tiny. Oh, look at that. The buttons are functional. It's probably the same buttons that obviously. And I got the eject doesn't work, and neither does this obviously because there's no cartridges. But this is cool. Show you all the sides the front where you put in the controllers but this one does not take those kind of controllers so where do you plug in the controllers hmm interesting oh I <laughs> guess I just figured it out uh, this opens up and here's where you plug in the controllers that's pretty cool they kept this cover in front so it looks like the original controller stuff perfect it's just a mini SNES right HDMI input power plug bottom Top, back. How awesome is that, right? And there you go. That's the SNES Mini. So, uh, hope you guys like it. I am going to cut out again so I can get into a wider view and show you guys the poster. Alright guys, so let me open the poster up for you guys. You can see my, my pretty face again. Uh, yeah, warranty bullshit. Don't, you guys don't care about that. Uh, let's see. Here's the poster. I guess the back has the instructions on how to set it up. Not really important. And here's the poster. Uh, I guess it's kind of far. You can't really tell. But if you look close enough, it's kind of what was in the back of the original Super Nintendo on the back end of the box, if you guys remember correctly. And it has the little squares that shows the little intro screen for each of the games. So that's pretty cool. The NES Classic came with one too. It came with like a, the original poster of, for the Nintendo. Now, now I got a Super Nintendo one. And at some point I'll put them up. But it's pretty cool. Now you're playing with Super Power, it says on top. So um, that's it. That's the unboxing. This fucking thing is fantastic. Now I have SNES Classic and the Super NES Classic. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this. Uh, the usual bullshit of link, share, subscribe, whatever. Um, I hope you guys can get one. Um, I hope it's not as hard as the original one was to, to get. But um, the guy at the manager at the GameStop did say that it was not going to be the same. And that Nintendo is going to be pushing out a lot more for everyone. So there should be more copies coming soon. And I hope you guys can get one. I'm really happy I got one and feel super fortunate that I was the last one to get one. That I got there just in time. I get out of work at the perfect time to pick this up super stoked um i i do want to turn it on and show you guys the menu screen but i am live streaming soon with my good friend jay from bristol in england and uh in about a half hour so i don't know if i'll have enough time to do that uh maybe i'll record it and then upload it afterwards either way uh you'll get it later today um thanks guys